All praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rakahakwadash. Double honors to my elder apostles and my elders at Great Millstone GMS. Peace and blessings unto the elect. This is the brother Atazari from GMS Houston. And um, they shoving this down the masses' throats, man. Okay? This, um, as a matter of fact, this whole month of June is. Uh, dedicated to the abominable acronyms uh movement okay and that their way of of existing okay i would say living but that ain't living there okay it's actually anti-life it's an anti-life way of conducting yourself okay and i'm gonna just show a few screenshots that i took all right, and this is from K. This is from a local news station here in Houston. Okay, you know we got a damn near talking cold man. You know, or oh, we do have to talking cold just so we don't get our videos flagged, man. You know, but it's coming a point they're gonna it, they gonna shut it all down anyway. So anyway, they changed their uh their logo background. Okay, and as you can see in the middle. Well, what's in the middle of that too? Okay. See, they they put it in your face and they're just shoving it down the masses' throats, man. All right. So let me do this. Let me scroll over. All right. This is another one. Okay. And this is an ad, as we see. Okay. Because they're in support. Okay. Here's another one. How to be an abominable acronyms ally. You see, they, they, they give you instructions on what you need to do, you know, to accept this. Look, everybody's not with it, man. Okay? The elect damn show ain't with it. Okay? First and foremost, the Heavenly Father and His Son, the one the world ignorantly calls God, whose name is Yahweh, all right? His Son, the, His only begotten Son, all right? The one that's coming back to save His people, all right? Whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus, all right? Whose name is Yahweh Shai, all right? He's the deliverer. That's what his name means. Okay? He deliverer. They are definitely against this. Okay? And it's scriptural. We ain't got to get a million scriptures. We know. And we know what the Heavenly Father says about abominations. He said he hates all abominations. And it's just not the, the, the thing itself. The transgression itself. But it also the one that's doing the transgression. Alright. And that's according to the book of Psalms. Chapter 5 and verse 4 through 5. Okay. He hated all sinners. Okay. Let's get another one. Alright. That's two again. You know I just found it. You know. And he had the 144, so I just go one more. Okay. And also here. All right. You know, and there's a price to pay for putting that abominable stigma on this sacred thing, man. This rainbow. Okay. Which was left for. Israel as a reminder, man. Okay. That was left as a reminder that the world wouldn't be destroyed the way it was with water. Okay. This time it's going to be with fire, man. Okay. And then this one, which I'm sitting, I'm still looking at the screen right now. Okay. Because I turned on the YouTube to check out the news, all right? 
And it says, watch live, Southwest Freeway, bridges lit rainbow colors in, and I'm, I'm pretty sure I know the rest, okay? You go downtown Houston, all the lights, rainbow, 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 okay? And they get ready to have they, they parade, and every, oh boy, it's terrible. Man, it is, it's terrible, okay? Like it says, Lot was vexed with the filthy conversation. How you think the most I feel about this stuff and his son? This got to go, man. It's about to go, okay? Let's do this and go here. Okay, with that, because that's enough. Okay, let's do this. Oh, I know what I did wrong. Oh, hell, I can just do this. So, like you. Know what? I think I'm a. Let's see. Because for some reason I couldn't. Uh... Okay. I think I'm, I'm like a chapter off or something or a few verses off. That's all right, though. We'll get it. We will get it. And there it is. It was chapter 2 and 6. So lucky. This is Second Peter chapter 2. Brother's probably sitting there like, yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's how, you know, sometimes when you're watching a lesson and the, the person that's the, that's the man that's teaching the lesson, uh, they'll forget something and you sitting there, you, you know what it is. But it's different when you're doing it. And you sitting on the other side listening. You know, it just crossed my mind. I find that that's funny. You know, so anyway, Second Peter 2, you know, but what's what this lesson about isn't funny at all, man. Okay. This is a filthy, disgusting place, man. Okay. And that's why it's, it has to be cleansed. It has, it will be cleansed. But not with water. All right. You know what? Uh, you know what? And I think that's at three. No, I'll come back if I if the spirit be on the brother. Let me see. Uh. Yep, I'll start at 4. This is 2 Peter 2 and 4. <laughs> so lucky. Like uh, for if the heavenly father spared not the angels that sinned, but cast them down to hell and delivered them into chains of darkness to be reserved unto judgment and spared not the old world, but saved Noah. This was during the flood. Okay. The eighth person, a preacher of righteousness, he was preaching righteousness, the opposite of what's taking place in this world today, man. This is a, a land of unrighteousness, okay? And it's promoted. Do as thou wilt. You know? Whatever, you know, whatever pleases your flesh, do it. You know? So what if, if 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 what it says in the Bible goes against what you're doing? So what? Do what you want to do. Please that flesh. Okay? That's what's promoted. 
And when you hear those that are in authority and those that make the laws upholding this and pushing it, well, of course, the, the people, all right, they're going to do as they did. They, they're going to feel like it's OK to do that. OK, and let me be more specific. A child's mind is very, very, it, it, it's influenced so easily. So if you're raised in this, okay, how do you think that's going to influence the way that that child thinks? You see? And they get in them early. You got these things, reading to children and teaching classes and all this, man. The Most High is not. That's why it says he's he, he's visiting this place. As we see the homicide rate here just in Houston is at an all-time high. All hell is getting ready to break loose, man. Okay? And as a prophet, as men of the Lord, we are required to give a warning. Okay? Let me finish reading this. This is probably be the only scripture. All right, that come out. Second uh, Peter two and four. If, uh, if the heavenly Father spared not the angels that sinned, but cast them down to hell, and delivered them into chains of darkness to be reserved unto judgment, and spared not the old world, but saved Noah and the eighth person, a preacher of righteousness, bringing in the flood upon the world of the ungodly. See, I was back then, water. Ain't gonna be no water this time. It's gonna be fire. And turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes. What, what that mean? What does that mean? Turning a city into ashes. What makes ashes? What makes ash? Fire. This place is reserved for thermonuclear heat. A whole kind of other fire. A whole kind of other heat. You don't even need air. You don't even need, it matter, it don't need oxygen. Okay. Everything is just going to melt. And a good example of that is the movie Terminator. When old Sarah Connor was holding that fence and her tongue was consumed away in his, in, in, in the socket. All right. Her tongue was consumed in her mouth, man. She was burnt up. That's what's coming to the masses. That lake of fire. The world of the ungodly is going to be turned into ashes. Second Peter 2 and 6 and turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemn them with an overthrow, making them an example or an example unto those that after should live ungodly. And delivered just lot, okay, vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. And the only ones that's going to be delivered in this time are the ones that have the same mind frame as lot. That's vexed. You know what? Let's break out the big dictionary. Let's get the definition of vex. And if the spirits say the same, now I stop right there. Let's go to vex. All right. Let's get vex. T U V. Yeah, right there. To irritate, annoy, prov provoke, um, 
to torment, trouble, distress, plague, worry. To discuss or debate, um, disturbed by motion, talks about vexing. Synonyms, anger, irk, fret, nettle. All right. So there it is, man. Okay. Vexed. Okay. Yeah. It, it will. It does bother us. Yes. It does trouble us. Okay. So it says, and delivered. Second Peter two and seven, and delivered just like vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. And that's what this world is comprised of mostly. Wicked. These people are all wicked, man. Okay. Um, For that righteous man dwelling among them in seeing and hearing. Seeing and hearing, man. Vexed his righteous soul from day to day. With their unlawful deeds. These things are against the scriptures, man. Okay? Oh, boy. You know? Verse number, keep reading. It says, The Lord knoweth how to deliver the godly out of temptations. Okay? And to reserve the unjust unto the day of judgment to be punished. So they're reserved. Who reserved them? Who's got them set up for destruction? Who's got them in this perverse spirit? Who's got this perverse spirit upon them? The Heavenly Father. They didn't choose to be the way they are. This needs to be taking place. Okay? It's all a punishment. It's all a, a, a show. It's... it's all gonna it's all to so it'll be just it's all a part of the heavenly father's grand movie man okay he's the he he's the one that reserved him okay for his will to be done okay and just say that for his will now, anybody got a problem with that, guess who they got to take that up with? Exactly. Oh, boy. Uh, that's pretty much it, man. You know. We see what's going on, and we know what's going to happen about it. And we know what's going to, what the consequence is. We know what's going to happen. It's going to get cleaned up with, 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 with fire. It's on to the next one, Shalom.